bass players. This is Crystal Baller. I'm going to show you how to play Rebel Girl by Bikini Kill on the bass guitar. If you're playing with a pick, keep in mind to use those down up strums with the pick and don't just get in the habit of strumming all the time down. Now you're more than welcome to play this song with your fingers, which is my personal preference, but to each his own. Let's get started. So we're going to shift our hand to the 6th fret of the E string. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. You're going to play this uh, first part of the song with your ring finger and your middle finger on the 6th fret of the E string, also called a B flat. You're going to strum this, or pluck it, however you want to say it, in uh, a count of 8 for the first measure. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The second measure is going to be five counts on the six or the B flat and then we're going to shift for the last three counts to the four on the E string and A flat. One, two, three, four. You're going to use your pointer finger for this one. So it's going to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then it starts over. So all together it sounds like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's that's pretty much the whole song. There's a, a little breakdown part we're gonna go over. Uh, that's starts out on the same part, the B flat or the sixth fret of the E string. Then you're going to go up to the 4th fret of the A string this time. So one string up, then back to where we started, the B flat, the 6th fret on the E string. Then up again to the 4th fret of the A string, also called the D flat. So that's that first measure. Now the second measure is twice on the B flat, then up to your D flat. Then we go up again, but we're on, we're on the same string uh, to the sixth fret of the A string or an E flat. So the first part of the measure sounds like this. The second part of the measure sounds like this. So all together it sounds like. That's it. That's the whole song. And then we shift back to our original. 